All right guys, Rich here from the RCNetwork.com and today we'll be unboxing the Z-Run 4268 Censored Brushless Motor from Hobbyway. Like I said, this is gonna be a fresh unboxing here of Hobbywing's newest 1.8 scale brushless censored motor. Now I chose the 1900 KV option for a particular buggy I have in mind, but there are several different versions out there that you can choose for your particular application. Now, like I said, censored, brushless, this thing is their top of the line 1.8 scale motor. So in this unboxing, we'll be cutting this thing open, seeing what we get inside the box. We'll go over some of the specs and you'll get an up close and personal look at this Z-Run 4268 brushless censored motor. All right, so the first thing we gotta do is crack it open. Got my handy ZT knife here and let's go ahead and cut this thing open. Want to point out also the official anti-counterfeit code right here. It's always nice to see that because you know this is an actual Hobbywing product. And like I always say about unboxings, you're never going to know what you're going to get inside the box here. And that's just like me and you right now. I don't know what's inside of here until I cut it all open. So kind of kind of learn together here as I crack this thing open and see what we get from Hobbywing. So Hobbywing is probably one of the biggest OEM manufacturers on the planet for electronics for remote control vehicles. And you can already see quality in here. I gotta say this box is heavy. Just unbox the XR8 Plus and, and this thing is like twice as heavy as that thing. So we're gonna go ahead and get everything out of the box and see what we get. All right, so here's a look at what you get inside the box. And before we get to the start of the show, let's take care of some of these supplement items. Right here is a full owner's manual, which typically you don't see in any kind of uh, motor uh, box. So nice that they're including just some specs and, and some information here about your new investment for your RC. Now you do get motor wires. Now 98% of motor manufacturers do not include this. They always include it in the ESC purchase, but they're hooking you up with some 12 gauge quality wire pre tinned on both ends and they're about eight inches in length overall so a nice little item that they're including at no extra cost now you do get two sensor wires here this one is quite long this is about 12 inches in length right here and you also get about a four inch one as well this thing is used quite often on my applications, but it's nice that they're including an extra long one just in case you have any kind of odd or maybe you got a monster truck or something that you're putting this uh, Z-Run into. All right, so well now for the star of the show. This is the 4268 in all of its glory. Like I said, I did choose the 1900 KV version. It's a fully brushless censored motor. On the back here, you're seeing the end bell with the nice sensor port right there. Do you have a couple of uh, bolts right there that has adjustable timing on the bottom here? Usually you don't see that on eight scale motors right there. It has, looks like a 20 to 40 degree difference. So uh, pretty nice. Huge motor tabs right here. Very nice that they are not only brass, but they have kind of like a concaveness to it just to make it easy to um, go ahead and solder up your motor wires. On the end right here, we're looking at a huge five millimeter shaft, and I will do some real world measurements for you guys here in a second. Looks like we have a six bolt pattern with standard three millimeter, and it looks like four millimeter bolt sizes right there. All right, so let's get some measurements of this thing. Have my handy calipers right here. So let's go ahead and do this thing. As far as the motor shaft here, this is gonna be an eyeball, but we're looking at right about 18 and a half millimeters in length. So if that fits your application, your motor's here. As far as the length of the can, we're looking at overall length of 67.6 millimeters. The can without the fins is measuring in at 40, almost 40 millimeters. With the fins, we're looking at almost 42 millimeters. And if you want complete end to end, we're looking at end of motor shaft to the end of the motor, 
at right about 86.5 millimeters. Well guys, that is my quick look here at the Xeron 4268 1.8 scale brushless censored motor from Hobbywing. I can't wait to get this thing installed in my new application and show you guys what it can really do. Well guys, that's it for now. If you have any comments or questions about this motor, please feel free to post it on down below. And as always, thumbs up and subscribe. That's it for now guys, over now.